hopefully soon it'll um, get back to be one of the really big, uh, big pretty campuses we have. So. Couldn't really tell you because no one's told me what it's about. I feel like they probably should have let us know. That should cause, it's causing some problems, honestly, for me. Like, I, I've been countless times where I woke up, sore throat, mouth dry, and it's honestly because I've walked past her constantly because I actually have a class in our building. So, like, I, I go by there every day. So, that's all I got to do with the I don't really have a problem with it. I just would like to know this cool. I think I think it's beneficial. It's, it, 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 it can sometimes be a little um, a little a little out of your way because you have to like walk around the fences and those kinds of things, you know. But but overall, it'll be good in the long run. Um, so it'll make everything match. Uh, it'll um, and um, it'll just make it'll make everything look a little bit prettier. Make make have more facilities, I guess, for the people. Uh, I think it should. I think it's great because um, I'm an interior design major. So I think that the tearing down the interior design and building up another one should is going to be good for the campus. for a while because I'm guessing whenever they're done with what they're doing they'll be building something new there. Uh, if I had to guess probably like two years. Uh, it's been a few months now so I'd say I'd say probably another year or so until maybe the most of it's done. I don't know probably about another year. Six six months to a year. Um, a couple months I'd say. I don't think it's going to get done immediately so a little while to go.